What's going on, everybody? It's your boy Cesar with Cesar Gets Crypto, and we are talking about Blue Cell BLZ. Looking at this thing on the weekly time frame on Binance, you know, I've got this overall fib from the last the uh, last bull cycle's high to the current cycle's low. This technically is the low here, but I'm, I'm going to count this low um, for this measurement. And here we are. You know, I mean, maybe if you want to do this, it'll bring the 382 lower. Maybe that's more conservative, I guess. Um, but I feel like that's the fake out low. I would rather take it from there, but um, whatever. <clears throat> it's not that big of a deal. Uh, if we close below this 382, that's the big deal that I'm trying to get to. If we close below this 382 on the weekly, we have two days, 20 hours left, essentially three days to do that. Um, I would say that the odds of us going to this 236, guys, which is down here at about 8.2. If you take it from here, it's at 8.4 cents. So somewhere in that area, which lines up very nice with this kind of bottoming area that we had down here before we started to crawl up, which is also kind of the last area that we saw this spike in volume, right? So um, all of that just kind of lines up with, with an area that's below about 10 cents and above about 8 cents, but the potential to go lower than that even is there. Uh, if we take this fib from the low here to this high, you can see we are at the 382 right now. Maybe we bounce from here, find resistance at the 236, and then continue to go lower. Um, maybe we just go lower from here or move sideways. Who knows? You know, time will tell. But to go lower than eight cents wouldn't be too out of the uh, expected, the realm of expectations, because this is the sweet spot right between the 618 and the 69, which is between about seven and eight cents. So we could even go lower than that and still overall maintain this kind of bullish posturing. But I do expect great things from uh, Blue Sale, you guys. You know I do. I'm just not tempted. I'm a little tempted to buy here. But I'm more tempted to sit on my hands and see how this plays out. You know, again, guys, be aware. Um, not financial advice. I'm not a financial advisor. But if we were to have a bounce here, we would look. If you're looking for prices to go lower, you'd look for a rejection off this 236. It is possible that we could go above that and generate a new high from there. Um, but but you know, at that point, I think things would look a little bit more obvious depending on what we do. But right now, we're kind of at a critical point both on the daily and the weekly, where if we get a a day or a week to close below this 382 that would be significant and really if we get a week to close below this 382 here um, I think that that would also be significant so we're in the land of the 382s closing below them will help us in our endeavors to go lower the 236 here is right at that 618 as well there's a lot lining up down there but just because there is there doesn't mean we can't find support here not only do we have 382s but we have a previous area of resistance support 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 um, that's all we got I guess but uh, you know it's a, it's a semi significant area overall, so don't don't count it out. I wonder if we take this low to high. Come on now. Oh come on, there we go. Low to high. Wow, <laughs> another three eight two. This is ridiculous, man. Wow, that is crazy. Yeah, look at that. You got a 382 there on this overall move, the overall bull cycle. It's the 382 of the overall bear market, right? Right there. And then of this little move here, like look at all these little yellow lines you got going in and there. There's just 382 after 382 after 382 all right here. So um, definitely a critical area. Let's see how we react. I can see why it serves so much as support and resistance. Um, we will see, you know, time will tell. And I think this week will be critical in, in kind of informing us about that. Closing below two out of three wouldn't be a bad start, but let's see if we can close. I guess this one would be the more significant one, closing below here at about 11.14 cents. But uh, I do think it's going lower, guys. Where I think it's going is probably between, again, this like 9.6 area to about eight cents, somewhere down there, but we could go even lower. So just be aware of that. Take care. That's all I have for you. If you enjoyed the video, leave a thumbs up. If you want to see more, hit the subscribe.